What's up, beautiful people? What's the deal? My name is Ramon, and I am the gangster, all black, to one. Here we go. Back in effect. A SDK leak. It's a bit of an annoying. You can't. Yeah. Nothing's a surprise anymore. No. <laughs> Everything gets spilled all into the runway. Yeah. I, and, uh, I would have liked to have had a nice surprise at whatever they had lined up. Yeah. And then. Yeah, you dive in, but no. Somebody gets in the SDK and they go crazy. <laughs> all right. So. Some of these, some of these are, most of them are really good. Yeah. Others, I have no idea what the hell they, what they are. But we're going to go down the list and just touch on what they are and then keep moving. And Flappy Birds is not a part of the list. No. I'll be saying that name a few times. <laughs> Flappy Birds. I think that is a, a, a silly name for a game, but. It was an even sillier game. Are you ready? Let's go. <clears throat> Audio video transcoding hardware accelerated. You know what that means? Diddly. Media editing. Audio and video. Audio effects. Video effects and slow motion video. That's probably very freaking awesome. Yeah, all Editing right. on the fly. Here we go. That's dope. Apps can capture audio and video for themselves. I'll rock with that. Yeah. Yeah. Stereoscopic 3D support. Why? <laughs> well, why would I need this? Um, I'm going to go on out, go out on a limb and say that this is probably has something to do with the sound and not necessarily visually. Okay. No. Yeah. Yeah. But it's like putting Dolby on your phone. Like, why? People listen through their headphones nowadays. Fair Beats enough. by Dre. He's making a lot of money. Fair enough. Yep. Wi-Fi Direct, a Wi-Fi standard allowing direct peer-to-peer -peer connections over Wi-Fi without an access point. Excellent. We uh, uh, honestly, welcome back Zoom, person to person. This is this is more like think of tethering. Yeah. I guess you could use your Wi-Fi to tether or use your phone to access drives or whatever. I, mm -hmm. It's geek shit. It's interesting that it's here. All right, keep moving. Hmm. Windows Phone 8.1 apps won't run on 8.0 devices until they upgrade. All right, you can obviously tell we did not sort this list. No, <laughs> it's just random. All right, documentation confirms all current Windows Phone 8 hardware to get Windows 8.1. Okay, uh, that's I'll have the 15.20. We'll have the update, so on and so forth. No soldier left behind. So will things like the 8x, the Lumia 900. Right. Or 920. What do we 920. have? 920. 920. Oh, okay. That's a, that's a good thing. Play 2 support is good. Right. That's on Nokia fills that gap right now. Mm -hmm. They've got their own Play 2 app. So you can, you can select like a song or picture or video mm -hmm. and play it to like your Xbox. Or I guess your TV if it supports DLNA, whatever. Um, and Xbox already supports it, so. Yep. Single sign-on for apps. Okay. That's that's pretty dope. So your win your Windows account, your Live ID, whatever, will get you into whatever they these apps want to do with it. Sure, why not? One less password. YouTube Player, including HTML5 video support. And you get a custom UI. Yeah, well, we, we already know what Google feels about anything YouTube <laughs> on a Windows device. So, oh, man. I'm, I'm not waiting for this. A file picker? Yeah, well. I, I thought that was interesting that it was not called a file explorer. What the hell? Yeah. Geofencing. You know what geofencing is? Absolutely not, sir. Geofencing, it's a fairly interesting concept. So geofencing is, uh, how do I explain it? Think about, uh, you tell you tell your phone what you think is interesting. Hmm. So when you get close to something you flagged as interesting, it'll let you know and interact with it. Okay. So think of Starbucks. If you say, hey, I like Starbucks, I like coffee, I like Target. Anytime you get in the vicinity of one... It lets you It'll know. say, hey, you know, the target down the block's got 10% off of this or that. And that's not, that's dope. That's, that's yeah, dope. that's that's cool. So, now you slide down to close apps. 
instead of the, the X in the corner, you actually slide down like like Windows 8. Right. Uh, navigation bar color selection. Yeah, I, that's I guess that's just the technical features, you know, minor. Okay. Whatever. USB choices. I guess when you plug it in, it says what do you want to do? Do you want to charge? You want to connect? That's right. Like, Right. Okay. This is Androidish. Yes, yes. I was just about to say that. This is getting real Androidish. <laughs> you know. Updated camera layout. Of course. Yeah. Why not? Yeah. Uh, the back button doesn't terminate the app anymore. Mm. You got to go in and do it yourself. Um, Interesting. VPN. Oh. Not bad for the enterprise. Right, right. Uh, OneDrive One drive. is integrated, formerly known as SkyDrive. Hoot, hoot. Mm. More efficient multitasking, I guess, work in the background. Right. Ability to install apps on se- inserted SD card. That's a that's, big one. That's a big one because it, it, well, it saves you space on your internal right. memory. And you before, you, you could use it before, but the problem was when you do it, you had to hard reset the phone. Right. Because the phone read external memory as all one internal partition. So. Right. It doesn't, it doesn't do that anymore. Ironically, I keep getting this error message on my phone saying that the, uh, the uh, error with the SD card, but it's it's reading my SD card. Should have bought an iPhone, bro. Yeah, I should have. Internet Explorer 11 improved with WebGL and normal mapping support. Okay. Mm-hmm. Separate volume controls. One for the ring and one for media. This is actually pretty important to me. Yeah. <laughs> this will get you got in a few meetings, people. Yes, it will. Don't get got in a few meetings. Xbox Music, Xbox Video, standalone apps, which we've already seen. Right, right. This is good. They'll let them update it at their own pace. Redesign Xbox Game Hub, which is pretty useless. Not that the Xbox one is out. We've been using the Smart Glass app. Right. So the old one's sort of useless. Twitter integrated more deeply into the Contact Hub. How, how more deep could you get? Right. I mean, <clears throat> maybe you can probably direct tweet. Right from there. Okay. Yeah. That'd be cool. All right. Uh, Facebook account option removed. Yeah. So no more uh, the, the Facebook messages is gone. Uh, but we do get a Facebook Messenger app, which is a good thing because we, we we're the only ones that didn't have one. Yeah. I, I didn't mind the, the, the Facebook Messenger integration. It's got some quirks to it. Yeah. For instance, if someone's offline, you can't reply back to them. It do, it's not smart enough or it wasn't integrated well enough mm. to say, okay, I'll send it as a message on Facebook and not like a messenger message. Right, right. Okay. It's, it's mind-numbing the madness with Facebook. Off with you. Yeah. Quick settings, uh, access for Wi-Fi, Bluetooth at the top of the screen. Right. Much like Android, when you pull down the, the curtain, you got the... Okay. We will also be <laughs> referencing Android as well. Action Center, which is when you, you swipe down from the top of the screen, where you see... Your notifications. No, there's different. There's a difference. I think the Action Center is where the volume media control is and where you, okay. you toggle on the, the communications. Um, solid notifications, which go through the Action Center. Okay. Mm-hmm. Uh, possible to mark live tile as red by swiping from the left of the tile. That's that's dope. Yeah. Auto update apps. That's something in Android I rather do enjoy. Yeah, cause the like, uh, well, it, it's really not auto update. Like in Android, Android, like I have my app set to auto update. Yeah. Why must I go into the app and approve the update? No, no, no. It's oh, certain certain ones. Or I think the developers flag certain updates as, okay, you need to do it. Yeah. But for the most part, a lot of them are auto-updated. Mm-hmm. So we get that and the ability to manually search if there are any updates for any apps. Okay, okay. Now we can't do shit. <laughs> we just wait. Yeah. When they, they update it, when they update Yeah, when the app says, hey, you got updates, then you got updates. All right. Uh, better background functionality, improved keyboard. I don't know how much more they can improve the keyboard, but goddamn it, they can only screw it up. <laughs> the keyboard yeah. was awesome, still is awesome, still is, especially on my device. Uh, Bluetooth 4.0, low energy. Thank you for Thank anything you. else but a Lumia because Lumia users have it already. Cortana, Four. <laughs> Cortana is the, the Siri, the Siri killer. <laughs> she has yeah. a gun to Siri's head. 
Yeah. <laughs> Give me that search engine. So I hope a lot of you know what Cortana is. That's the Master Chief's... Uh, Master Chief's UI. Yeah. And I, I really hope they keep it, this name. I, 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 yeah, I think they will. And um, I, I hope it has her voice. Yeah. Yeah. Because, <laughs> like... That would be it, dope. If it has her voice, if the speech isn't robotic... Yeah. It's, it's going to be a mash down. Oh, man, I can't wait. And I remember when they were talking about it, they said, you know, we didn't want to... They already had... Because they had Tell Me. Right. They purchased Tell Me like four years before Siri came out. Or was it two? It's, they, they had Tell Me for a while, and they had this technology sitting on it. But they said they weren't going to release a Siri competitor if it was just... A Siri competitor, right? This has to be more. They right. They, there was more, so I'm really excited to see what is the more. Like, what did you do? You well, know what I, mean? I mean, I was reading up on it, and it, I understand that um, it it learns. Yeah, it's not just okay. Uh, Siri, how? What's the weather like outside? Tell me a joke, Siri. Yeah, it no. It's it's not like that. I'm excited to see what that's about. Man. Yeah. Can't wait. Notification center now. Right. Notification this is what we've been center. waiting for, right? Because you miss a notification that's not a, from an app that's not pinned to your home screen. Right. Good luck. Yeah. <laughs> you don't know what the hell just went off. So this will pretty much be like the uh, this this leak images running around. This will be like the curtain in Android. Yeah. I I, I guess the curtain is just simply. It's the go-to. It's the easiest oh, yeah. way to view uh, notifications without uh, actually going into the note. Yeah. Uh, you know Easily my saying? favorite part of Android. Yeah. Easily. Not Apple. Android. <laughs> New gesture based keyboard. Mm. So they're talking swipe. Right. Or the Google keyboard, how you, you know, you just hold your hand and drag the words. Um... And that's that's it. That's a that yeah. That's we we left a few out. There's no flappy birds. Um, and it's it's um, it's it's a lot. Really, as as previously stated, it's very Androidish. Right. Um, I I can agree with this because I think this would force like now you have no choice but mm. to. At least see what a Windows phone is about. Yeah, it's comparable. All right, and it there is, it, it's it's. I agree. It's just an awesome laundry list of awesomeness. Yeah, it reminds me of Mango. Remember Mango? Right. We got like a flood of shit. It was like, yeah. whoa. Yeah, and then they came out with 8.0. Yeah, 8.0 was good though. Really. 8.0 was good. I like 8.0. I ain't got no beef. Yeah, but you know, it was the, it was totally different. Yeah. So they're definitely pushing the envelope here. Yeah. Stay tuned. Our build is coming up soon, so we'll, we'll get to see. And are they going to allow us to download a? Sure. If you got the um, the dev account, which was like twenty dollars, I think it was the other day. So I have to dev account my. Yeah. No, I don't have a dev account, sir. So. Well, you better get to getting. <laughs> if you want the goodness, yeah. I so, know. I'll, I'll probably have to uh, fork over that twenty. There you go. You know. Well worth it. Well, anyway, I'm Ramon. I'm Tawan. We are out of here. <laughs>